Hi, I'm uh, Judy Paul, and this is my studio. Um, I'm going to tell you a little bit about what's been going on around here lately. Um, I I thought I was going to do these every day, but I got caught up in printmaking. Uh, I print reproductions of my work and mount them. And since I kind of talked about that once already, I didn't want to keep talking about the same thing. So I've been basically printmaking and delivering prints to places for the last um, week or so. But um, I did make a new discovery in the printmaking piece. I um, Last time I talked about mounting these prints, I was talking about using this, which worked okay, but um, it's a adhesive roll, and you lay it down, and it's very sticky. Um, but it's very narrow, and I have big prints that I make. And so, anyway, I did a lot of research, and I found this um, Scotch 568 positionable mounting adhesive liner. And this stuff is perfect. This is it. And it's really uh, sticky, but uh, not so st sticky that you can't move the print around. So I lay this down on top of my one of my panels, and uh, like that, the sticky side down. And then they give you this blue squeegee thing, and you burnish it down, peel it up, and it leaves a, la a little even layer of adhesive. You can put your print on top of that. Once the adhesive is down, so you could put a print down on top of the and he said that would be sticky and then I'd put this on top then I would put this on top and burnish it down really well and then I trim around the edges so that it's flush with the box and then and then it's down I mean it's permanent um, adhesive so this this is this is the solution for mounting my prints on these panels. Um, but let's see. I uh, painted today. I uh, thought I'd talk a little bit about my palette because I put down a new palette today. Here's my daughter Haley. Hey, hi Haley. <laughs> but anyway, I had uh, it's been a week since I painted, so my acrylics have dried up, and that's just a common problem. So anyway, I use my exacto knife and I cut around the edge of this acrylic sheet and I put down new cling wrap and tape it down on the edges and then I put my paint down in an order that makes me happy um, I start with my whites and browns yellows oranges reds blues and then grays and blacks so I pretty much always put them down in this order and um, these are acrylics, and I uh, I use this spray bottle a lot while I paint to keep everything nice and juicy. I also use this to dip my brushes in. This is water. And then this is my medium, uh, That this thing that I use for everything that's an adhesive plus a varnish. So I keep all those things on my palette while I work. And um, these are the paintings uh, that I've been talking about for the last couple of weeks, and I made a little bit of progress on on these. Uh, these were candlesticks. <laughs> I put down some color paint collage, uh, really bright colors in the background, and then I've been working on continuing that. I really am happy with they are with how they are right now. Um, so that's where I am today. And uh, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.